my lovelies welcome to starlight and stitches thank you so much for joining me here today if you have been here before then hi welcome back it's really good to see you back here again and i really really appreciate you so so much i hope you've remembered to subscribe i've got a wonderful subscriber base so if you haven't and you decide to join them you're in great company if you are new here welcome this is Alice Land and I am Alice and in Alice Land I talk about all sorts of yarny stuff, crochet stuff, amigurumi, I do crochet book reviews, yarn hauls, um, I do end of the month project videos, I do all sorts of things related to crafts, crochet and that kind of thing so if you think you might like that then come and join us and subscribe down below. Today um, I had a phone call um not so long ago to say that my daughter's glasses had arrived in town so what i'm gonna do i'm gonna hop on a bus i'm gonna pop into town to pick up her glasses but i think i'm gonna have a little look in the only shop in town that sells yarn because they've got a sale on so i'm gonna take you shopping with me do you want to come shopping with me yeah it's not um a huge like yarn store it's just a high street store and um they're called c and h which is cloche and hamblin um and uh, yeah, hopefully they'll have some bargains. I don't know. So um, let's head out and you can come with me and I'll try and inconspicuously film myself while I'm out and about. Come and join me. Let's go shopping and let's see what bargains we can find. I bought some stuff I didn't need to buy anything um okay yeah so the sale was quite good um their full price stuff their prices are a little on the higher side for example I did check out the price for their Starcraft special chunky um and online at the moment I think the cheapest I can get it for is £2.15 a ball theirs is £2.40 so it's a little bit more on the slightly higher price side but obviously you're getting it in a shop so you get it straight away and you don't have to wait for it to be posted out anyway didn't get any of that I've got some other stuff <laughs> I spent a little bit too much money um but this is money that I'd put aside for crafts and crocheting so I have saved for it I have a little stash of money that I keep um because I'm not going out anywhere at the moment I am literally just at home so uh the money that I would have spent by going out then that kind of goes towards my hobbies instead so I'm going to show you what I got um I do have my receipt here because I need to remember what I've spent and how many of each thing I have bought so what I'm going to do as well is I'm going to have a look at prices online while I'm editing and I will put up in a little box um, how much I paid for each one and how much it is online. Um, all of these have said that they were 50% off so um, I know they were reduced. I'm just going to double check um, and hopefully not be cross with myself that I could have found them cheaper online. Anyway, let's get into it. The first thing I got was this it's actually a book this was 25 percent off and this is 35 crocheted bags that one there 
and it's by this lady here, Emma Friendlander Collins, that one. Um, and yeah, there's 35 bags in there and I've actually got an inkling um, that I'm gonna be making a few bags pretty soon. I've been looking at some stuff online and I think this is gonna be really helpful. Um, there's some gorgeous patterns in there, some lovely different types of bags. They've got phone cases and purses and things as well. They've got day bags, they've got beach bags, all that kind of thing. And I just thought that this would be a really nice addition to my collection. So um, originally it was 12.99 and I'm gonna just put up on screen how much I know, I've got it on my thing. I paid £9.74 for it today. So that's pretty good, I think, for a crochet book. And you've got 35 patterns in there. So I'm very happy with that. I will add that to the ever-growing pile of books. Nico's going to have to come down off there soon because he's not going to actually fit in. Um, but such is my life. I just keep adding and adding and adding more stuff. Right, what's next? I got... This is nice. Now, this was... I think this was 50% off um, and again all these things that I've bought I have actually got ideas for it's when I get around to making them so I have got plans for them I haven't just bought things willy-nilly um, but this lovely yarn here this is the King Cole Drifter Aran and the shade is Blue Ridge so it's got all these lovely blues and creams there's a little bit of sort of greeny turquoise in there as well really really lovely I bought four balls of that, so I've got 400 grams of this. Each one of these balls is approximately 218 yards, which is 200 meters. Um, it's 79% premium acrylic, 17 cotton, 4% wool. Um, it says it's fully washable, 40 degrees, uh, lay flat to dry. Um, recommended needle size is a five millimeter. It doesn't give a hook size, but I have got a plan for this. Like I say, I've got four of them, so I'm really happy with that. And I paid £2.85 a ball for that one. Um, and I will put up on screen now how much is the cheapest I could find it online. Um, it did say in the shop that it was 50% off. So I'll have a look. The next one that I got is another King Cole one. See, I haven't had King Cole before because I bought everything online. I've kind of stuck with what I know um, because it's really difficult when you buy stuff online. You don't know what you're getting. So it was quite a, a joy to go into a shop and just have a little feel, or a little feel of stuff. Um, yeah, um, this is a another King Cole one. It's called Beaches DK. Okay, and it's, you can see on the side there, that's all the gorgeous colours in there. Very pastel, pinks, lilacs, yellows, greens, really lovely colours. This I would like to make something for my daughter, something summery for my daughter for this. Um, let's have a look at the instructions. So it's a 100 gram ball. Um, it's 70% premium acrylic, 30% polyamide. It's approximately 278 yards, 255 metres. 100 gram balls, uh, 40 degree wash, and yeah, recommends a needle size of four millimeters, no hook size recommendation, but swings and roundabouts. Um, yeah, so the Beaches DK, this color is called Beaches and Cream, and I brought two of these for £2.20 each, um, which I thought was pretty good actually. Um, I love the colors, and I know that pastel colors are really, really in season with fashion this year, not that I'm a fashionista, but I know what's popular. I just don't go with what's popular, but my daughter will love this. So I need to think of something really cool and funky to make for her with this. I have two balls. I'm thinking like a sleeveless, like duster cardigan thing. She could chuck over the top if she gets a bit chilly, but she's got her arms free. That's what I'm thinking. So yeah, that one. Um, again, I will put on the screen now um, how much the actual recommended retail price is, blah, 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 that kind of thing. So, the next one, what shall I look at next, this one? This next one, uh, blah, 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 I'm just, I'm looking up my receipt, you see. I don't want to get my information wrong. So, this is Seda Snuggly Crofter, Baby Fair Isle Effect Chunky. Those colours are so pretty. Look at all those gorgeous colours in there. It's quite autumnal. 
but there is some pastel shades in there as well there's like a pastel orangey yellow I don't actually know what I'm gonna make with this one um, how many did I buy of this I bought I bought seven of this one um, I don't know why I bought seven I think I just picked up what was left in the basket because I thought that'll make a nice project I don't know what I'm gonna make um, the balls are 50 grams each and each ball I paid pound eighty-five a ball for this one um, the shade it doesn't have a shade name but the shade number is 0507 for that one okay and let's have a look at the information right it's 55% nylon and 45% acrylic I'm not sure how nylon works let me know I've got some super knowledgeable people in my subscribers let me know how nylon works as a crocheteable thing can you use it for wearables surely you can because we have clothes with nylon in does it make you hot let me know give me some info help me out um so each 50 gram ball is uh, about 75 meters or 82 yards and it says machine washable 40 degrees dry flat and recommended needle size six and a half millimeters hook size six and a half millimeters so i like that i really like that i just need to decide what i want to make with it as we always do when we find lovely stuff and we don't know what we're going to do so next i have right these are the same but just in different shades and i went a bit mad with these these were the most expensive ones that i bought but i touched it and i shouldn't have touched it but i touched it and it was so soft and it was so scrumptious so this is sublime evie prints and these are gorgeous so this one look at the colors it's like a sunset reminds me of a tequila sunrise <laughs> which i haven't had for many years um but that is beautiful and then this color again it reminds me of being by the sea but it is so soft it really is gorgeous and I fell in love with it um, so the greeny blue color that doesn't have a shade name but has a shade number 586 and the orangey color where's the thing where's the thing oh where's the thing ah 611 okay so that's the two colors now with these I went over the top and I bought 10 of each because they are only 50 gram balls. So I've got 500 grams of each of them. I need to make sure that whatever I make, I don't run out. Um, oh God, I can't get over how soft it is. Oh, it's so nice. It's so nice. I want to make something beautiful. So let's go through the bits and pieces. So with this one, 50 gram ball approximately 115 meters or 126 yards what's it saying here uh, cold hand wash only wash dark colors separately dry flat um, recommends a hook size of five millimeters needle size of five millimeters what's it made of hello Oh, it's there. <laughs> it's 94% cotton and 6% nylon. Oh, I just, I love this so much. I would never have picked this. If I'd just been online, I would never have picked it. But it's, hang on, let me get a, let me get a what's it. Look at that. Honestly, it feels wonderful. I would make a bra out of this and have it that close to my skin. I shan't because I want people to see it. I think it's going to have to be something wearable. This is really lovely. Sublime, the luxury brand by Serdar. Is it Serdar or Cedar? Do you see? So that's what I did today. I spent money on yarn that I shouldn't have spent. But it was worth it because I've got some new stuff. And um, yes, my amigurumis will always come first, but coming up to summer none of my clothes fit me so I need to make myself some things uh, get old lockdown weight putting on um, I've got 
lots of content coming up for you so hopefully you will stick around um yeah that was my mini shopping haul um i've got some other yarny content coming up for you in the next couple of weeks um and also of course crochet book reviews and um you never know you might see a crochet roulette very 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 soon we love crochet roulette um yeah once again i've rambled on for far too long i hope you like the yarns i've bought i hope you like my little video i will be back with you very very soon please look after yourselves and please look after your loved ones and i love you very much and i will see you soon Mwah. goodbye <laughs>